The question is, let P be a prime number, the quadratic equation having its roots as factors of P is, so we know that factor of P is P equal to P into 1. So roots, roots will be P and 1. So now quadratic equation, quadratic equation will be x square minus sum of roots into x plus product of roots means there will be x square minus p plus 1 because this is the roots into x plus product of roots means p into 1 equal to p equal to 0 so it is the answer now the question is if the equations 3x plus y equal to 1 and 2k minus 1 into x plus k minus 1 into y equal to 2k plus 1 is inconsistent then k equal to question mark so we can write it a x plus b y equal to c so then there has two equations so a1 equal to 3 b1 equal to 1 and c1 equal to 1 also a2 will be 2k minus 1 b2 will be k minus 1 and c2 will be 2k plus the equation will be a1 by a2 equal to b1 by b2 not equal to c1 by c2 so we will put the values in here so 3 by 2k minus 1 equal to 1 by k minus 1 not equal to 1 by 2k plus 1 after that from here 3k minus 1 equal to 2k minus 1 now 3k minus 3 equal to 2k minus 1 therefore 3k minus 2k will be 2 so k equal to 2 so that is the answer but the question is if triangle abc similar of triangle pqr am and pm are altitudes of triangle abc and triangle pqr respectively and ab square is to pq square equal to 4 is to 9 then an is to pn equal to question mark so if the diagram is like that that is a b c and that is p q r so the altitude will be a m and in here p n so therefore we can easily write that a b a b by p q equal to b c by q r so c a by r p equal to a m by p n a b square by p q square equal to 4 to 9 so a b by p q equal to root 4 by 9 it will be 2 by 3 n is to p n will be 2 by 3 so this is the answer now the question is the radius of sphere whose volume is 12 pi centimeter cube is so volume equal to 4 by 3 pi r cube that is 12 pi so we can cut pi pi and by 4 we can cut it also by 3 therefore r cube equal to 3 into 3 so r equal to root cube 9 therefore 3 square and it will be 1 by 3 that means that 3 to the power 2 by 3 so it is the answer next question is the value of 9 6 square theta minus 9 10 square theta is so here 9 into 6 square a means 1 plus 10 square a minus 9 10 square a so 9 plus 9 10 square a minus 9 10 square a so it is gone here 9 is the answer now the question is two cubes have their volume in ratio 1 is to 64 so the ratio of their total surface area is so therefore volume of cube is a1 whole cube by a2 whole cube equal to 1 by 64 therefore a1 by a2 whole cube equal to 1 by 4 whole cube so we can cut 3 and 3 therefore a1 by a2 equal to 1 by 4 so if this is the side a of a cube then the total surface area will be 6 a1 square by 6 a2 square so after cut the 6 therefore 1 square by 4 square that means that 1 by 16 so it is the answer next question is the 21st 
turn of the AP minus four and half comma minus three comma minus one and half to is so n is twenty one. So it is the first term. Therefore, a equal to minus four and half. And the difference between first and second portion is d equal to minus three minus minus four and half. Therefore, it will be three plus four and half. So therefore, this is minus three plus four point five, means one point five. So therefore, we know a n equal to a plus n minus one into d. So a twenty one will be a equal to minus four. And a half plus twenty one minus one into one point five. Therefore, minus nine by two plus twenty into one point five. Now it is two minus nine by two plus thirty. Therefore, minus nine plus sixty by two. It is LCM. Therefore, fifty one by two. So A is the answer.